Usually the intensity in his eyes, that guy knows something, he knows something. Es, bueno, surrealismo es muy importante y sobre todo en Cataluña. Cinco palabras que definan la ley. Es bastante difícil encontrar las cinco palabras en medio de las cinco mil. Most people know that the public dali, the showman, but there is a person behind the mask. He was generous, he was hardworking, sensitive, and he opened our minds in a period of darkness. Landscape had a total influence on Dali's work. The shimmering silver sea, the whitewashed houses in Cadaqués, the violence of the elements in Cap de Creus, where the rocks are shaped because of the wind. Here it's where he, he found his inspiration. Since he was a kid, he read a lot of books, painting and sculpture and architecture and music and maths and science. All disciplines could be connected and in this way they get to be more, more complex. I think what people doesn't know about Dali is that he was a very romantic person. This castle is a present that Salvador Dali made to Gala, his wife. Here we can feel a very personal Salvador Dali. Dali uh, had to redesign a whole castle thinking about his wife. It's the answer to the influence that Gala had in, in his life. I think they both were inspired by each other. When he was studying in Madrid, he would get the avant-garde, the futurism, the cubism, and in the end, when he finds the surrealism movement, he feels this is right for him. Sí, yo creo que se dedicó sobre todo a transformar realidades, o sea, cogía elementos reales, rompía un poco la realidad. He had uh, quite a lot of uh, fears, giraffes, ants, elephants. Gala encouraged him to paint all the fears. In the Palace of the Wind, we can see Gala and Dali represented together and a reference to Sigmund Freud and the draws of the unconscious. All that these draws contain, the intellectual wealth that Dali gained through his experience, comes from upside down and just falls on you. Once you're here, enveloped in the area, a lot of his paintings and his art make sense. It's incredible. <laughs> One of his greatest desires was to be known and that his art arrived to a wider audience. Dali would be really impressed to be in people's homes. For the people of Spain, was the most international artist. Pues bueno, al final creo que también es parte de la cultura española. And he's still relevant today, right? I think he will be for a long time. He stimulates people generation through generation and always asks you more questions. After hearing that Salvador Dali is going to be on the Frame TV, I'm going to buy one now. <laughs> <laughs>